everyone and welcome back to the happy heart. I'm so glad that you guys came over today to watch this clean with me. I fully intended to clean my entire house and then I actually just got super busy and couldn't clean the whole thing. So I ended up just kind of doing my living areas and getting a lot of laundry done. But I did film it and I wanted to show you guys that you know, even if you don't get everything done that particular day or if your plan kind of goes awry like it did on this particular day for me, to not um, really get too down on yourself and just get done what you can and just be happy with what you can get done. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and those bell notifications so you know every time I upload a new video. Right now I'm trying to upload on Sunday and Wednesday cleaning videos and in between kind of doing some fun videos, but it'll probably be some cleaning videos too. If you guys can't already tell, this is kind of my catch-all area in my house. What's your catch-all area? Because this is like my laundry room but slash where we come into the house so I think that's why it catches so much stuff and oh my goodness I just had to get it cleaned off it was just driving me crazy on this particular day so I'm just trying to catch up on some laundry and I'm listening to this song I'll show you guys in a minute it's kind of my new favorite song so check that out if um, you like worship music because it's kind of my new fave
probably I sit on the floor and do my laundry because I just feel like my front loaders are really low to the ground and it's easier for me, but I know that's really strange. And I actually fold everything right out of the dryer usually, and I know that's weird. Most people don't do that. It's just something I do. I feel like if I wait to fold the clothes that everything is wrinkly and I don't like it, so I will actually throw them back in if I've waited a while to fold them for some reason, get all the wrinkles out, and then fold the clothes. I know, crazy OCD things, but it's just something I do. I also fold the shirts like this because this is what my husband prefers, and it took me like five years to be okay with folding them like this, and now I just do it out of habit. So it's funny how we have those little quirks that um, we just kind of have lived with in our life and got used to, and that's one of mine. So I just wanted to tell you guys about that. I know this isn't a very long video, and I didn't get a whole, whole bunch done. I didn't clean my whole entire house, but I decided that I just want to be happy with what I can do and not really dwell on what I can't do or what I couldn't do that day. And I hope that whoever needed to hear that, that that really rings true to you because sometimes we put so much pressure on ourselves to have a perfect house or a perfect home or perfect children or perfect families and none of that is a reality. So I just wanted to put that out there that I was just happy this day that I got everything done that needed to get done and God knew that this was all I needed to get done this day. I'm so glad that I can share that with you and I will see you guys in my next brand new video. Thank you again for coming over and cleaning with me.